What's up guys and welcome to the first video of 2020. Uh, my name is Patrick, known as Paddy here on social media and welcome to the new year. I hope you all got into the new year safe and soundly. Uh, I hope you celebrated, I hope you had a great holiday, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, whatever you're doing, celebrating wise. I hope you had a great time with your family and friends. Most people have some form of new year resolutions, which I have to state right now, I have nothing against that at all we have the mentality of oh next monday i'll start right or it's a new year so I'm, we're gonna start this i have a new plan but the, the most famous one is you want to get into a better shape uh, but if you set those standards and you actually follow up on them all good uh, but personally i said like quarter goals so i know for the next three months what my goals are um and uh, second quarter third quarter fourth quarter and then ultimately i have yearly goals and of course you tend to set them as the new year begins so it's not a resolution but you use the new year for something right um which is why i'm, I'm totally fine with people setting new year resolutions uh, so for me a, a thing that i have this year is 2020 my number one priority is going to be my health it's just that simple right i want to hear your goal that you have for 2020 down below um because somebody out there can be struggling with setting up a goal or whatever it might be, you're gonna get inspired by that. So if you guys will comment down below your 2020 goal, that would be absolutely amazing. The thing I want to talk to you about, guys, is the the switch that is in the dropshipping space. Um, and these are my thoughts for the new uh, year that we're coming to. Like, what is changing? So number one, the old dropshipping days where you can just sell crap pretty much right and not do anything much about it it's over right it just doesn't happen anymore customers don't want that um people are getting accustomed to either quick like either great service uh quick shipping and just overall a good looking branding right uh, when they shop online so those days are over and there was all they were pretty much also over in 2019 but but now for me i feel like going into 2020 it's just dead it's not gonna go anywhere so now you actually have to build a real business and you have to put more work into it but that's just great because honestly if you don't go into dropshipping with the mind that you're actually gonna do this for like you're gonna build a real business or you're gonna actually you know, like have a work a job a business here right if you don't go in with that mindset you, mindset you shouldn't do it at all right uh, because that's you shouldn't do business any other way so that's just great plus we'll have way better products, way better designs, or sorry, way better stores and brands, and it's gonna be amazing, right? Uh, we are gonna win. So what you have to think about it going into 2020 is that when you're building a store, when you're finding or uh, picking out products, when you're branding yourself on social media, you have to have to be high, high quality. You have to have great, great customer service, especially as you're a dropshipping business because you tend to lack on some on some places that can be shipping times that can be uh, branding when it comes to the packaging um, compared to uh, stores that have their products in storage um, so therefore you have to catch upon that with great great customer service um, and we have to make shipping times better you can do that by getting a private label service where you pretty much uh, you could um, that could be Silk Road. They have great. That could be an example. Silk Road. They have great um, shipping times. But it can also be that you find a, a, a third party um, supplier, right, or a, or a shipping center, or whatever it is, where you can actually buy bulk as you would usually do if you have a storage. Uh, but then you just send that bulk over to them, and then they will package the orders, uh, brand them, and send them out. Um, with a fast shipping time right that could be something that you pretty much should do um in 2020 if you have something really, really going uh use, using the dropshipping model still works perfectly fine but you can always advance it and make it better right so uh, i can keep on talking about this i'm probably gonna go more in detail on my instagram so if you want to follow me and want to learn more and be like on the froth on the, on the front end of, of dropshipping so that whenever changes really really start to happen you will be prepared instead of that you're going to lose all your money and business right so go down below that's going to be my instagram click there give me a follow uh, i'll follow everybody back uh, and then um 
you, you, you can be more prepared because I'm just going to share a lot of things in there. Um, and while you're at it, um, I'm not sure I have a link actually when I'm thinking about it, but um, just go to my Instagram then or, then or if I have a link. If you want to be mentored by me, if you want to get some help by me, if you want to get my course, whatever, uh, DM me uh, or hit the link below. If I have it, I'm not sure at this point, so you'll know after the, you'll know do, watching this video. Uh, but else, just go to my Instagram, DM me if you want some help. I will gladly help you out and possibly you can figure out jumping on a free call to figure out if you're actually going to go on a mentorship. Uh, so. That's just my quick thoughts on how we're going to do with 2020 when it comes to dropshipping. And and just to sort this out, people who say dropshipping is not going to work in 2020, or you can even go as far as the people who say 2020, sorry, dropshipping is a scam. That is just ridiculous. Saying, for example, a scam, right? And saying dropshipping is a scam is exactly the same as saying, um, you know, working at Walmart is a scam. Doing forex, forex trading is a scam. Um, selling clothes online with your like your own merch is a scam. All these things that will all be a scam if dropshipping is a scam. Dropshipping is simply just another business model. It simply can be a scam. What people think is a scam is when they've tried it out and it didn't work. Boom! Suddenly, it's a scam. Right? It's too good to be true. No. Because when people say it's too good to be true, that's because they have to have the not they don't have the knowledge yet. They think you simply just gonna put some products on, sell it, boom, that's it. No, it's exactly the same as if you have a storage room filled up with products. That storage room is just in India, uh, China, sorry, right? And they're gonna ship it out for you. You still have physical products you're selling. You still have to use uh, marketing, paid ads, organic traffic. You still have to promote your products and then sell them and then ship them out and move them on. There's people behind this, right? So it's not a scam and it is more than doable in 2020. You just have to sharpen things up because people are getting accustomed to great service, quick shipping times, great brands. And that's just good for you because if you focus on those things, the chances are that your store, your brand is going to last for so much longer because you actually have a brand. Right, so I think that's pretty much it. Um, tomorrow I'll be out with a new video. Tomorrow's video will be a video that's a bit more in detail with some specific stuff when it comes to drop tripping. That can be when running ads, that can be when uh, finding a product, that can be when setting up the store. I'll figure that out, but just stay updated. Go down, click the subscribe button, click the notification bell. Uh, I hate to say this, but it's always great because I subscribe to so many people that I always forget to do it. So if you can do that, you'll be ready for tomorrow's video where we're going to talk more in depth of some great, great things you can do with drop tripping uh, when it comes to specifically doing it, right? Um, so yeah, man, I think these video are videos, I'm going to try not to edit them, right? I want this raw experience. If I fuck up, I fuck up, right? Uh, I don't want to put any fake nuance on or something like that. 2020 is going to be an amazing year. I'm, I'm already sure about it. Um, no matter what, I'm looking forward to all the challenges. I'm looking forward to all the problems we have to figure out ourselves. I'm looking forward to sharpen up my life in every aspect while still, ha still having a life. I'm super, super excited about that, man. But hey, this is it. Go down below, click the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, like this video, dislike it, whatever you want to. My Instagram is going to be down below as well. Shoot me a DM, follow me, I'll follow you back. Without further ado, I'm going to see you tomorrow in, in the next video. Have a great day, guys. See ya.